I decided to motorize the uh, Lego material handler and it turned out to be a great learning project. Um, a lot more work than I thought, but hey, what the heck. Um, in doing so, this is the original base. Um, I had to build a mobile base. I wanted this thing. Uh, my stated objective was really to be able to fill a little bin, uh, so I had to keep it mobile with steering and drive. Um, so I really didn't need the feet as much. Um, so I was able to squeeze it into about the same form factor. A um, little bit of a longer wheel track, but um, I got rid of the feet, so it kind of fit nicely. And obviously the next piece I had to do was squeeze three motors in the base, so one for drive, one for steering, and then one to rotate the uh, turntable, um, which meant I needed a bevel turntable, not the not this guy. Um, I still don't understand why they made this, but hey, they did. So there's three motors in the base, then I needed three motors to control the valves. Um, I went with the Mindstorms uh, medium because those have the uh, rotary encoder that's very accurate. Um, I decided to go with the Mindstorms hub so I could use a PlayStation controller. Um, I had six total connections. Um, I know that Brick Controller makes uh, a similar thing to be used with Pybricks, and I've used Pybricks, and it works great, and I love it. But um, overall, I found the latency always to be a problem with that, so I had to use this. Um, when I started operating it, it really didn't have a lot of power, so I had to, on the pneumatic power, so I had to make a little compressor, um, which I did here. I had a Bovis motor, motor. I used a Bovis 3.0 to power it. Then I had to store the air, and then I had to get a gauge to uh, find out how much air I had in the tank. Um, so that was able, that allowed me to be able to operate it, you know, on a, on a good basis. And then for kicks at the end, I put a micro motor on the cockpit so that I could control that. And, um, Basically, it was a little fun. Uh, let's see, uh, eight total motors, two batteries, remote, and um, I don't know, about a dozen hours. <laughs> um, but you'll see what happens next.